have a firmware course about the Seagate. Seagate, there are different models, huh? different payment. Uh, just like a uh, WD we have seen, huh? WD there is two need, power, SATA. But in a Seagate, we require the terminal okay. to connect a terminal here. Huh? Okay. To connect a terminal, we require terminal. Okay. Uh, we have a dongle. We have a dongle. Uh, we will give you dongle free. You can use okay. a normal software through the dongle. Okay. Huh? If you have MRT, PC3000, DFL, they already give you a dongle. Okay. No problem. Okay. But if you don't have MRT and you want to run the small, small command, you can use this dongle. Okay. So normally Seagate required only terminal. Okay. Most of the terminal to read, write, plist, glist, smart reset and all those things that you have to connect. Huh? Okay. So this is you have to connect three wire that is an RX, TX and ground that you have to connect here. Okay. Huh? And we will use the command. I will show you the software so, how to use. Okay. So if you don't have a MRT, Seagate, DFL, you can use this tool. Okay. This is your USB to TTL converter, which okay. convert USB to terminal. terminal. Then you have to connect this. We, have, we will give you one piece. Okay. As a student, we will give you free. Okay. You can use this if you don't have any tool. Okay. Okay. So for basic repairing, you can do it. That every hard disk has some terminal. Small hard to have a terminal here. See, hmm? small hard disk. This is what USB case. It come in the USB case. This also USB case. This is okay. internal laptop. Okay. Laptop hard disk. This is USB. It's on Seagate. Okay. Huh? This USB extension. It come in the Seagate model. Okay. Huh? With the okay. converter and USB socket. Okay. WD you have seen that is coming with directly USB socket, but it is converter okay. using. Hmm? So this is coming like this cases. See, these are the case. These okay. hard disk come inside this. Okay. Huh? On okay. one converter they are using USB. Okay. okay, so this also we can do convert. Okay. In a WD, what we have seen? We have converted okay. USB to SATA, to SATA, but it's already coming inside SATA. So, okay. no need to convert USB to SATA. Okay. Panasonic USB to SATA we have to convert, but here it's already SATA okay. connection. Okay. Okay. okay, so it, when you open this, it will be this type of hard disk is inside. Okay. So, we will show you different models, families. You can see the family name also here Skyhawk. Huh? This is your Barracuda, Barracuda. Okay. Skyhawk, huh? these all are the models. Okay. 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 So we will see this on this. In some, these type of hard disks are lock hard disks. Okay. New lock, new SMR drives, new hard disks, they are coming. They will not use terminal command till you unlock this USB hard disk. Okay. Huh? okay. So you know, you some, this new model also DM, LM, VM. Okay. Uh, this model also has a lock PCBs. So therefore that we have to unlock these hard disks. Okay. Hmm? So these are the process what we will show you in the our course. Okay. Before this, you have to understand step by step what is the service area, where it is like WD we have studied. Yes. Here also we will study which are the module important, which not important. Huh? Okay. LDR files, ROM only one files that we will see step by step with the course structure. Okay? Okay. So we will start our uh, module first. Okay. about introduction hard disk, how to identify families, uh, which are the important modules and all those things we will explain. Okay? Okay. okay. Thank you. We will start the class.